Hello everyone, and welcome back to Unabridged. Since last time, I've done a bit of work around the decorations, got some books added into the bookshelves in all the places that we had them, but I don't think that's really important right now, because I want to start a new project. And for that new project, I want clouds. And clouds that I really would like are these, the fluffy cloud and the wispy cloud, because they look the best out of all of the clouds that are available, and they're the easiest to get. Because, like, these, they're chisel cloud blocks are, you know, they're okay. But these, these look really nice. So, we need to get the fluffy and wispy clouds. But, in order to get the fluffy and wispy clouds, we need to go to part of the Twilight Forest. I can't see, because it's, like, so far down in here. Um, yeah. It's, it's like a giant... It's like a floating island with a giant. This is Hardcore Under Expansion. That's Twilight Forest. It's like a floating island and a giant. <clears throat> um, yeah. So we need to do that. Um, but in order to do that, we have to progress through a whole bunch of other stuff first. One of those things is the maze. And in the episode where we killed the lich, I said I was going to find a maze. Um, yeah. Apparently, <laughs> the mazes spawn in swamp biomes, which I didn't know until very recently when I looked it up and realized that I could go into a swamp biome after killing the lich. So, <laughs> once this loads, there we go, I waypointed it on the map. Uh, where was that waypoint? Right there. So, this way. There. There's the maze. It's in a swamp. Which is pretty, pretty cool. Yeah. We couldn't go there before because the mosquitoes, there are mosquitoes that appeared whenever we tried to enter. But now we can. This is a swamp. We're just, we're just chilling in it. It's perfectly fine. No mosquitoes. Anyway, this is the maze. The blocks in the maze can't be broken. Well, they can, but not easily. So, this will be interesting. Let me come down here. Yeah, I see this moist stone. Oh, actually, it's much faster than I thought it was, but down we go. Yeah. Okay. Breaks faster than I thought it did. Um, night vision. There we go. And there will be a lot of enemies. <laughs> but I just need to find the way down. And there's bedrock, too, so you can't cheat. You gotta find the way down. Um, I'll probably edit a lot of this out, but if anything interesting happens, I'll be sure that you all get to see it. Alright, well the second floor is the last floor. And the miner's room spawns in a room like this. But it hasn't spawned. And I could... I wouldn't really want to do this. But I could find another maze and do it in the other maze and see if it spawns there. I'm uh, gonna check a different maze and see if I can get it to spawn there. Okay. Alright, I found another maze. I made six blank maze maps. I'm already on hard difficulty. I will fight this thing and I will kill it and it will happen. So, here we go. This, yeah, yeah, there he is. Ugh. Finally. Found you. And now I will kill you. There. Was that really worth it? I have to eat, I have to eat your stew. Oh, I don't. I just have to get it. Nom. Pretty good food, though. Not gonna lie. Ugh. At least it was faster. Probably didn't even need the maze map in the end there, but I did it. I did it. Okay, and now, um, I can't use this, because the character spins around unnecessarily, so, kind of difficult to use. The next achievement on the list here is the Hydra, which is an actual cool mob, instead of this lame maze. But I'm gonna zoink out of here, poof, and we can go back into here and then go and fight the Hydra. Yeah, still, I'm so annoyed. 
Why? Why didn't he spawn in the first one? It just didn't make... Ah, I didn't charge in my porter. It didn't charge all the way. Okay. That's kind of annoying. But I can deal. I can deal. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It is A. Okay, Jose today. Mole. In we go. Maze is this way. So let us go this way. Fire Swamp is where the Hydra is. It's pretty easy to recognize. You look in the normal swamp, and you get to a part that's red. And there's this huge hill. And that huge hill is where the Hydra is. Hydra's freaking amazing. Assuming, yeah. Yeah, that's my boy. My boy, the Hydra. Prepare to die. Doink. It's a thousand health? Jeez. Can I hit you? Do I have to, like, hit your head? Oh, that's how this works. Okay. Oh. Well, I'm killing you a lot faster than I thought it was going to be. Loud noises. Loud noises. Very loud noises. Extremely loud, some might say. Die. Come on, you're almost dead. Just die for me. Just, just die. There we go. Boom. Easy win. <laughs> yeah, fighting these without this stuff would be incredibly difficult. I'm just gonna admit that. It's kinda, kinda cheap, what I'm doing. But, yeah, okay. What's next? What do I have to do? Um, a touch of... Okay, I got that. You know the fiery weapon, while oh, wearing at least one piece of fiery armor. Shut down some over hydra meat when your food bar is empty. Okay. Claim your title by placing a trophy on the pedestal in the dark forest ruins. Uh, magic map. Dark forest ruins? Where is... Is that that thing? Um, I have to go toward the second maze. So the first maze is over there. So I need to go this way. And that should take me somewhere. Not entirely sure where I'm going. But I'm sure I'll get there. <laughs> dark forest. Here we go. Also with night vision, this place nearly isn't nearly as dark. Okay, what is this? Dark wood. Fitting name. Don't know what exactly I'm looking for. And there's a lot of foliage in this place. And this is off my map, so that's not going to help me. But... Um, should be like a pedestal somewhere. Ah, here we go. This looks like something. And that appears to be a pedestal, along with some helmet crabs. Beautiful. And if I do this, beautiful. Amazing. I should be able to take that back. Yay. And now, what are you? Set all the restless phantoms in the Knight's Tomb and the Carbonite's Tower devices will obey you. Uh, where's the knight's tomb? This is another maze, or maze-esque thing. It's like a dungeon. Okay, going down is usually a good thing. It's a pretty interesting room. <laughs> Some emeralds. Oh, I should still touch this. For my emerald farm. I can make it a little bigger. Some more emeralds. Is there any more? Yeah. Well, don't fall. Falling is bad. <laughs> Alright, cool, I got some emerald door. Nice. Ow. What? Oh, goblin knights. They got armor. Armor for days. I'm gonna just leave. You can have fun. Alright, bye. Looking for the knight guy or whatever that I'm supposed to kill. Obsidian? Here? Is this it? You're gonna spawn? Whoa! Yeah, this looks good. This looks like a... There we go. That was easy. Whoa. Everything's mad at me. Ow. 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 Can I kill you? Yes. You're dead now. And you will all be dead soon. Wahaha. I'm gonna grow big. No. Chest. Whoa. That's a lot of extra damage to armored targets. Sharpness, three. Dang. Um, well, 
it's not that useful to me, but <laughs> is there stuff on these? Possibly. Again, not going to be that useful to me though. All right, what's next? Um, touch the fire hitch. Here's the your guest. It's your guest. Can I mine up through the floor? Will it let me? Uh, yes. Okay. Now I need to go up through these trees, or I can just come out of the forest. All right, this tower. There is a way that you're supposed to kill your guest, but. Yeah. And the tower inside is pretty cool too, but I'm not about that life. I just head right to the top, wait for your guesses. He's kind of big. Hi. Is it not going to let me kill you? Like that? Really? I'm supposed to get him above this. Without it blowing up. Ow. Can I get my crossbow? Do I have that? Yeah. Let me try and kill you with a crossbow. Oh yeah, this works. Beautiful. It has now stopped working. Can I hit you with the sword? No. Do I have to do the gas trap? Is it like required? Ow, I'm taking a lot of damage. You. Wait, you heal? What? I don't approve. Just die. That's all you gotta do for me. Just, just die. Okay, if I keep shooting him, he'll die. No? Okay, I'm just missing. There we go. Beautiful. Flawless execution. Sort of. Where did the trophy go? I kind of need that. You know? Oh, it's in there. Okay. Yay. Um, touch the fiery red tears of the year guest. This? Can I drink some or can I throw it and pick it up again? Yeah, there we go. Tears of fire. Okay. Um, you have to find the yeti. Okay. Um, after I send all of this back. Uh, yoink. Where is the Yeti? Have I found a snow forest? Or a snow biome? Yes, there's one over here. So I need to go the way I'm facing, pretty much. And then this way. Lag. Well, not lag, just the world loading. Yoink. You're pretty high up there. So there should be a cave with a Yeti inside. Yeah, this looks like a Yeti cave. Okay. Beautiful. Come inside. Yeti. Alpha Yeti. Where is my boy, the Alpha Yeti? Did he decide to not spawn? Ah, whoa, 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 whoa. Where is the Alpha? Should be an Alpha Yeti somewhere. Is there another Yeti cave? <laughs> somewhere? I mean, is there one? Yes, but where? Hopefully, yeah, here we go. Let's see if he spawns in here. Please do. <laughs> Alpha Yeti. Yeah, see, this is what I want to see. The Alpha Yeti. He's much bigger than a regular Yeti. Ow. Though he still dies quite quite quickly. Alright, there we go. Alpha Yeti Fur. Can I use this for anything? Oh, Chills Attackers. Interesting. Very interesting. This is very low on power. No, it's low on durability, not power. Why is this so low on durability? Nothing else is low on durability. That's kind of weird. <laughs> to the glacier. Where we will kill the Ice Queen. At the top of her tower. Very similar to your guest. Except she's inside. Also, penguins. That are so adorable. Oh, here we go. This is Ice Queen. This is the Ice Queen. Charge! Hi, how are you? Good? Can you stop phasing up and down through the ceiling, please? Oh, it's Snow Queen, not Ice Queen. My bad. <clears throat> Die. Yeah! 
clear skies. That is a lot of snow that you dropped, Mr. Missy. Missy. <clears throat> okay. Let me get rid of... Not that. I need this, please. Okay. I'll get rid of, like, this. Don't need that. And all of these snowballs. Don't need these either. Or the Alpha Yeti Fur, the Ice Bomb. I got a Tribo. Sounds pretty cool. Um, I don't need the trophy either. Alright, let's head back out. What's next? Got that. Um, find the Lamp of Cinders in the Troll Caves, and you can burn away the Thorn Barriers. <clears throat> okay. So, Spruce. That's the Spruce biome. I believe. Okay. Alright, we have arrived at the Highlands, Spruce Highlands, uh, and we're looking for a troll cave. And this is a couple of days later from the previous stuff, and this looks promising. I already started to record this, <laughs> uh, and then found out that I wasn't actually recording. So now I'm back. Again. Guess who's back? <laughs> so yeah. Um, not entirely sure what I'm looking for. At all, really. Um, the Lamp of Cinders, that's what it says here. Lamp of Cinders in the Troll Caves. I have no clue what that means, <laughs> or what it looks like. Lamp, Lamp of Cinders. It's not craftable, so... Guessing it's a chest that I find? But, I don't know. <laughs> um... I may have to Google it if it comes to that. I may have to look this up. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'll be right back. Alright, well, upon checking the wiki, it appears that there should be, like, a giant obsidian cube somewhere that we have to break into. However, <laughs> it apparently can only be broken with a giant pickaxe, which means that... This isn't the first step to getting into the thorn biome. Apparently the clouds come first. Yes, okay. Clouds. The whole point of us coming here for the clouds. And now we get to kill a giant. Because that's pretty cool. Also, castle. That's pretty cool too. <laughs> hey, there's a giant. Isn't he cool? He's a real, he's a real nice looking guy. Uh, learns from the best, looks like the best, he just is the best. Ow. Also pretty, pretty, uh, pretty weak, I just two-shot myself. Die. There we go. I got a giant sword, and I should get the giant pickaxe, yep. Wah. I can break this now, if I wanted to. Which I don't for the most part, but it's there if I want to. And I can also get clouds now. I will come back to get the clouds in between episodes. I want to just finish the Twilight Forest in this episode. That's sort of my my goal. My intention here. All oh, this castle looks pretty cool. Anyway, giant pickaxe obtained. As it appears, this is the place. Oh, there's more than one. I think this is the main thing that I'm looking for. Unless they're... Oh, nope, this is it. <laughs> The one that's huge. Yeah, that one. <laughs> Alright, let's mine in. And hope that this doesn't take 20 years. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I see pixels. Alright, it's not going to take too long. Good. Because if, if it was a regular stone pickaxe mining length, that would take a very, very long time. <laughs> so it doesn't, which is good. Ow. Did you just, you just mess me up? You can die. You can seriously just die. I'm not... I mean, I could build a wall around myself, but I feel like that would be too much effort for this. <laughs> it's like I'm playing Cake Wars. You gotta build a wall while you mine in. And if there's more than one block, I'm gonna be kind of annoyed too. Which there probably is, now that I think about it. Because this is like a 4x4 four four cube or something like that? I don't know. Boom! Oh, never mind. We're good. Coal, emeralds, control sign, obsidian thing that we're looking for, a lamp of cinders. Some uber soil, magic beans. So you have to drop it and pick it up again. Wow, I wish for more burning. 
That is not entirely true. Make it past the Thornlands. Thornlands. And unlock the door of the castle. Assuming I can remember the way I came in. Which I think is just follow the path. Here. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, completely different thing. Also, the Thornlands would be really cool. Um, because, like, if you break them just normally, they, like, duplicate. And that's pretty cool. If you can't, it's an axe. Uh, where's my axe? If, like, look. If I can see it, like, sprouts new ones. But then you take the Lamp of Cinders, and you right-click, and it burns it. Or if you hold right-click, you can, like, burn wall, all that, and then you just break it. And doesn't grow back. However, flight. Yeah, what is this? This is a pretty cool looking block. Castle brick. Interesting. Where's the door? That's a door. Um, this, this looks like the main, main entrance type thing. Unlock it. Do I just click it? Is that an achievement? Unlock the door of the castle. Did I... Is there like a special... Oh, is this the final boss of the Twilight? Twilight? I don't know. I mean, it's possible. I'm not entirely sure what we're supposed to do. Since so castle very well requires past the thorns. Unlock the door of the castle. I thought I did that, though. Alright, according to the wiki, there are... No boss or enemies residing within. So. Cool. I guess that's the end. Twilight Forest has been beaten. Aw, oh, yeah. I'm going to take a screenshot and make this a thumbnail, because it looks pretty cool. Well, um... What's the hedge maze achievement? Oh, I already have it. Okay. Cool. Not entirely sure how to do these. Uh... I can Google that too. And as it turns out, nothing. <laughs> no, they're just they're just empty achievements. Which is okay, I guess. I don't really care too much, but yeah. Alrighty then. Well I'm gonna leave this here. Gonna have to figure out how to make it back to my base. Because that's super far away. But I'm gonna leave this here. And like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Leave a comment with any feedback you have for me. I'll see all of you later. Bye.